No shiver me timbers, today be vlogging day 1039, it's my sister's birthday! I got to pillage something so I can get her a present! found my dad that Chemex. Now put it to use. For those of you wondering if I brought my mug all the way here, no, I did not. You can actually, you can buy these on your own. My dad has one, uh, you know, links below. Good morning. It's, it's uh, Tuesday. Today's Tuesday. We're headed off to an appointment here shortly with uh, my mom. Go see her, hang out, you know, do that kind of stuff. And then uh, we'll see what the, see what the rest of the day holds for us. You're not in focus yet. Oh well, that's there. That's, it is. This is the problem right now. I'm trying to figure out how to get the manual focus auto this focus lens to work. Yeah, auto focus works just fine, but but it's not catching uh, exactly. Uh, the lens. Kimchi, pickled onions, carrots. The toast here is pretty nice. The meeting this morning went well. We got another one shortly, but you know, coffee with the dad is good. I'm trying to use the new lens, which for vlogging might be a little bit tight. I don't know. It is really tight, but it's uh, I really, I'm really, really enjoying this lens. And I just got to figure out how to use it. Versatility. Just got to figure out how to. I'm not going to use it for vlogging like this very much. Don't worry. going at it right now. We'll uh, maybe take a stroll over towards the falls. Oh no, hold on. The river is definitely running wild right now. This is great. You really want to be, if you're going to come to Spokane and you're going to come to the river, you want to come when it is flowing like this. This is really, really, really cool. Anyway, the meetings have gone really well today. We've had a few, have some more lined up this week. I'm feeling a lot better about everything. It's definitely going to be a challenging transition, but we're really fortunate to have a really good team of people around my mom, uh, around my parents both, but seeing how everything's coming together, seeing how my parents are both adjusting to the idea of maybe this being the beginning of the next stage has been really, really helpful. It's been really good to see them processing. It's been good to see the improvements in my mom. She's definitely doing a lot better in the last few days. And it kind of is, it, the reality is definitely trying to push to make sure that my dad gets some rest and take care of him right now. And get them both you know started on this next track as well as possible so we're gonna take a stroll through the park here and then we got to go uh, get a new prescription for my mom and, and take that to her and uh, we'll see what the afternoon holds from there seen this at all since they actually they've been doing a lot of construction down here for a while they even made like an ice skating ribbon around the park a lot of construction still going on but it's looking nice this is very different than it used to look feels more open and accessible 
I'm looking forward to seeing how they finish it up. We're gonna grab sushi at the place that I loved all through college, sushi.com. But before we do, last chance. Do you want something else? Yeah, do it. Are you sure? I'm sure. Sweet. I'll make you happy. Well, yeah, but I mean, there are lots of things that'll make me happy. <laughs> but for right now, this will make you happy. This venture. thinking that all those years trying to get you to stop playing with your food never paid off. Sushi was great. It was very tasty. Now, more stuff. I don't know what I was going to say. Errands and, you know, some family time and then I'll talk to you from the garage, I'm sure. How's that? I can't see what's going on, but I have a feeling that this is gonna be perfect. It's my hope. Things are going really well. Uh, I am tired, very tired, but that's largely because I came into this exhausted. So it's a, kind of a rough way to start a trip, especially one that's gonna end up being kind of emotionally taxing, but it hasn't been too bad. And the last couple of days have been really good, especially in seeing how my mom is improving. It's been really, really nice. So she seems to be like stabilizing and improving really well. My dad is on that road as well, but I think he's got a little bit of a longer road ahead of him. And so it's been good to just, you know, focus on him and spend time with him. And I've literally just been spending all day every day with him, uh, which has been great. It's fantastic. It's, it's, I'm really, really fortunate that I can do that. So that's amazing. I canceled my trip to San Diego for the few of you that knew that I was going down there. I was going to go see my sister and bounce around a little bit. Uh, originally, actually, it was my dad that bought that ticket because he thought I would really like to go do that. But then he asked me to just stay here instead. I wasn't really ready to be alone. Wasn't, you know, just needed some time. So I, I stayed and it's been well worth it. It's been really good. I would have loved to have gone to San Diego, California. I miss you as always. Uh, and it would have been great to spend some more time with my sister and brother-in-law. But they are coming up in a few days. Uh, so we'll see them for very briefly. But we'll at least get to see them, which is really nice. So... All in all, feeling, yeah, great, a little tired and really overly full. I kept lunch really light today because, man, um, American portions and something that's going on in the food definitely fills you up a little bit more, but also just like, oh, it feels a little bit weird. So, I mean, I'm enjoying it. I mean, I'm, I'm just gonna go ahead and sugar myself to death while I'm here, but I'm, I'm paying for it in small, <laughs> definitely in small amounts. So that's basically what's going on. I don't think there's any really big updates uh, besides just saying that, yeah, things, I feel like, I think, feel like we got in, we handled things kind of, you know, with time to spare. Uh, it was definitely a rough patch there for a bit, but it really feels like we've been able to stabilize things and we're making some difficult but good transitions uh, and they're actually going really well and really smoothly uh, to start in even better than I would have uh, would have hoped for in, in certain instances. So definitely coming into this ready for things to be a little bit rougher than they were. And that's, that's great. We're really, really fortunate that that's the way things went down. So figured you, I'd give you a little bit more garage time here today. I am gonna go over. I I've been using and loving the Peak Design clip here. This thing is amazing. Martin, thank you again. I'm gonna play around with it more, but I've really, really been enjoying that. And I am gonna talk about, in the next couple of days, at some point here, maybe when I pack, I'm not sure, but I'll talk about the strategy that I had in mind when I decided that I would literally spend 10 days on just this backpack. Uh, and so far, so good. That's all I got. I'm gonna see you, I'm gonna wrap it up here and just, uh, again, we gotta go, we're gonna go see my mom here in a minute and spend some time with her. So I'm just gonna focus on my family for the rest of the day and uh, put this together later, of course, upload it, and I'll see you bright and early tomorrow morning for, you know, again, whatever the heck is gonna happen here in Spurkin, Washington. See you tomorrow.